Hello everyone, Chief Meteorologist Brian Hale. Our cloudy, cool, drippy weather continues. Our drippy hasn't amounted to much as we have anywhere from a hundredth of an inch at Edinburgh to just a little bit more than a tenth of an inch at Brownsville to show for it. Temperature trend, well, it shows the recovery begins toward the end of the week by Thursday and Friday. We're looking forward to mid to upper 80s across the valley, but we've got to get there first and plenty of cool temperatures still in store for the valley as Tuesday we peak at about 68 degrees. That's cool to mild, but still with plenty of clouds and the slightest chance for a shower in the forecast. It's not the best weather. Here you can see the chance for rain ramping up in toward Wednesday as a mid to upper level low pressure moves across Texas and helps to increase our shot at showers. Could even throw in a few thunderstorms for Wednesday. Check out Tuesday. Nice mix of clouds, chance for a shower here and there, nothing super duper. But then that uh, mid to upper level low comes out of the west and comes across the Lone Star State. And as it cranks counterclockwise, it will draw moisture and energy across deep south Texas. If nothing else, it may fire up uh, stronger thunderstorms over the mountains in Mexico south of us. And then some of that energy could then come pouring into the valley. So we'll keep an eye on that for you. Future cast shows, same time frame, uh, Tuesday, Wednesday that on Tuesday we're pretty much looking at the same scenario of lots of clouds and a few showers ramping up to a more substantial chance for rain overnight into Wednesday and uh, on Wednesday that opportunity for rain peaking as that low moves across the state. Seven day forecast shows the opportunity for rain and then thunderstorms Wednesday and then it kind of lingers into Thursday a bit in the morning but then gives way to improvement in the forecast for Thursday afternoon and Friday with temperatures in the 80s. Lower Valley are looking closer to the lower 80s and even the weekend with a weak frontal boundary coming through on Saturday we still manage a pretty nice forecast. That's a look at your 24-7 forecast.